hello friends in previous video we have seen the complete flow of angular project and what is component and in this tutorial we will have we'll be having a look about the arrangement of project structure like we have discussed previously that there will be lots of components created while the development of application so it is very necessary to arrange these components properly uh, in a precise manner so that the structure of the project become easy to understand and readable so let's move towards our main working directory which is source and app as you if you have seen the previous video we have created some demo component okay and as an as application goes on developing there will be lots of components so it is better that we arrange it properly so the first folder that you need to make is app config and within app config you have to create again a new folder which specifies as app start okay now just move app.module.ts file to app start once you move it in app start the other two files will be created automatically as you can see here now delete this app.module.js and app.module you have to delete this it is no longer required outside and app.module.js.map so it is no longer required now we have shifted app.module in app start now it is necessary to move other component now if you see when you create a new angular project uh, these files will be automatically added and amongst them this one app.component.spec.ts this is not required you can directly delete it and it's js.map and it's js the two other files okay so now we have two components demo component and app component so now uh, create a new folder at app hierarchy so i'll just click on app and new folder where i'll write views the folder with title views okay it has been created now what we need to do is create again a new folder and give it any name that you want now if you are creating a component for student section you can also give the name as student to the folder so it completely depends on you uh, now for a time i'll just give the name of component app and again a new folder demo okay so just move .ts file to app and the other two files will be automatically generated you can see similarly for demo just move demo.component.ts file to demo and other two files will be automatically created it will need about maybe 3 to 4 second to create the file so the other .js file and .map file you have to delete it it is no longer required now we have moved the components and the app start setting to its individual folder but it is also now necessary to change the path okay now let's go to main.ts now you can see the red underline under this because as the path is changed so it is present in app slash app config slash app start again forward so you can see that the red sign is gone now now uh, we have to go to app module so if you see here we are getting error for both the component that is app component and demo component now we, we have to go in this particular folder now we are in app start so we need to go two step backs and it can be done by this way dot dot forward slash again 
we have gone one step back now another step back okay now in views and then in app you can see the error sign is gone similarly for demo you have to go two steps back one step two step and then views and then demo and slash now the error is gone so the module settings are been done now let's move in app dot component to see whether if it's all right okay it's fine again here it's fine now we should have our application successfully running i have my npm running my command prompt so i don't need to again type npm install or n sorry npm start i just press control f5 and i should get my output the uh, hello uh, amol and hello demo component okay so everything is working fine so this is how a project is to be arranged in angular js okay this is a working directory source and in source will be working in sub directory app now in future if we have to add any additional component we need to add here in views okay and once we add in views always make sure that you have to update it in module this way going two step backward as per the hierarchy so uh, now basically uh, this is basically my po point of view actually you can also arrange the project depending on your requirement but uh, most of the time in many industry uh, this is the technique followed so i wish you are getting uh, what we have did today the project arrangement so that in future when the project becomes bigger when you add lots of component it should be readable okay uh, hierarchy wise so that's it for today today's tutorial and please do not forget to subscribe the channel below by pressing the red button and see you guys